Montgomery County judge found the daughter of a former U.S. diplomat guilty for murdering her schoolmate back in 2020. Our Cheyenne Corinne covers Montgomery County and heard from the victim's family today. So Sophia Negroponte now faces up to 40 years in prison for the murder of her friend. Today we heard from the victim's family who described Yusuf Rasmussen as a kind and gentle soul. We will carry him with us forever. Prosecutors say 29-year-old Sophia Negroponte killed 24-year-old Yusuf Rasmussen in a Rockville home in February of 2020. It happened just blocks from the courthouse where a jury found her guilty of second-degree murder on Tuesday. According to court documents, it started as just three friends hanging out in the house having drinks. I'm fine. I'm fine. I mean, emotionally, no. Right. Uh, physically, I'm fine. Prosecutors say the third friend, who you see in this body camera video, played a vital role in the case. The witness says Rasmussen and Negroponte got into an argument, and then the argument escalated. All of a sudden, she grabs a knife from mm -hmm. the drawer. Okay. And like, just like that, they're arguing. Like from the kitchen drawer? From the kitchen drawer. Like Police say they found Negroponte laid over Rasmussen's bloody body yelling, I'm sorry. Negroponte's lawyers tried to use the defense of involuntary intoxication, but the state's attorney said she knew what she was doing despite the substantial amount of alcohol consumed that night. There were six hours of video of uh, the defendant in this case that showed exactly how she continued to function despite the fact that she had been drinking on this particular occasion. Sophia also is the daughter of former United States Ambassador John Negroponte. Her family says she acted in self-defense. Rasmussen and Negroponte both attended the lab school in Washington, D.C. together. His family denies the claims about self-defense and say she cut short a life that had meaning, purpose, and potential. A loving person who brought our family and his many friends great joy in his 24 years of life. In Negroponte, sentencing is set for March 31st. I'm reporting in Rockville. I'm Cheyenne Karen for DC News Now.